Hello, my beautiful gamers, and welcome back. It's me, Siren, and today we are on another episode of Silent Hill 2. I feel like I always have a story time, but today I have yet another story time. If you are not interested in said story time, there are sta ta mm -mm. timestamps down below, so feel free to just skip them. But if you are interested, here they are. Firstly, disclaimer, I have already recorded a portion of this video, so I'm going to replay a bit because my game didn't work. No better way to put it. I just had extremely bad frame drops for no reason at all and I literally could not play my game. I obviously recorded it so I have footage that I will show you guys at the end of the video. The reason why I'm showing it at the end and not now is because there are a few spoilers and a few new things that we encounter so I don't want to just put it there boom in front and then you're like what? So I'll put it at the at the back, but I'm wearing the same outfit, so don't be confused when there's different gameplay. But I think I look a bit different. I think my nails might be a different color. Anyway, so yeah, I had severe frame losses to the point where I literally stopped recording and was like, I can't do this, I can't play like this, and spent a lot of time looking for fixes and ways to improve it and i did find a few because there are a lot of people with the same issue and apparently the developers are even aware of this problem and funny enough just the other day i watched a streamer play this game not to watch because i don't want spoilers just to see how her game runs and she also had some stutters so it's just <sighs> It's an amazing game, but it does not run the way that it should. I'll leave it at that. I think I recorded for like eight minutes and was like, I can't do this. So it's really not that much, but yeah, it was bad. I, I religiously just couldn't play. I'll show you. I'll show you later. Then the other thing is that I will tell slash give an update of is my dog got hive. So... For those of you who don't know, he essentially had like little and massive red bumps all over his chest area and his paws and legs because he has very sensitive skin and he was allergic or got a reaction because we threw compost on our grass. Now, don't worry, this is not a common th thing. We googled, we asked the vet, and it's not common at all. It's very rare that your dog has an allergic reaction to grass or compost or whatever you call it. Um, but yeah, that happened. That was very scary because, again, his entire little body broke out in hives. He was itchy the whole time, scratching, and he was like super baby mode. He was like cuddling me all day, and he got like very sleepy and low energy. But he's fine now. He's 100%. He's clear, and everything is fine and perfect now. And we have learned, and it was just scary. Like, I'm just one of those people where I can't deal when an animal is even remotely not comfortable. Because I can't explain to him, like, please just drink this tablet, it will make you feel better, or please don't scratch, it's just gonna make it worse, or it's fine, you just shouldn't have stepped on grass. <laughs> and I don't know, I just always feel so helpless when something's wrong with my animal or any animal because i just wish i could explain to them that it's going to be okay you know so yeah that was that was kind of difficult for me especially more story time because when he was little he had a lot of skin issues and he had a very bad case of mange actually and he lost all of his hair it was kind of cute so yeah me and him has been through a lot so just seeing him all itchy and baby again just it wasn't easy, but it's fine now, so thank you so much for everyone who wished him well and asked how he was doing. It really meant a lot to me when I posted about it and yeah, all of you showed concern, so thanks for that. But yeah, we're back, ready to game, hopefully no technical difficulties. If you hear strange noises, we have stormy weather now, again, all of the sudden. It's like a stage four storm warning. Whatever you call it, I don't know anything. You should know this by now. But yeah, so hopefully everything goes well and I'm talking too much. So let's game. 
Okay, here we are. Not fully right where we left off because I just saw I don't fully have a save that will take me to exactly where I was before my game started breaking. So you guys missed one new enemy and that is we encountered a nurse enemy for the first time. But you'll see that right at the end of the video where I have my little montage of frustration and how my game broke. But yeah, so... We just came to the hospital, I think Mary, Maria, whatever is in here, and we have to have a look around. There's a keypad we need, and there's something in the director's office, and the only way to get there is to go all the way around. I always press escape instead of M. But yeah, here's the only thing you guys missed. My bad. It's the nurse. Um, yeah. My bad. I'm, I'm really sorry, but yeah. I just thought I, do, I don't have a save that goes back to... Before... She attacked me. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to backtrack way more than I want to. And yeah, like I said, you guys missed like 5 to 8 minutes. Really not that much. You wanna climb in that? Okay, my game seems to be running much better. I, I kind of have consistent frames now. Oh, guys, it was bad. I'll stop complaining about it now, but it was... bad. This game gives me major trust issues. Oh. Ooh! Creepy. Well, there's another one. And I can't figure out if they're hostile. I mean, obviously it's an enemy. But I feel like they don't... Hello? Attack like the others. Oh, oh, I've been here. My bad. Again, disclaimer, I did play for like five minutes or so. And my game was- this enemy in particular, you guys will see later. Oh! My g My game, like, froze. Oh. Oh, I wish I could- Okay, here's our first combat test to see if my frames hold up. You guys ready? I'm scared. I'm- I was genuinely nervous for today's recording because of how much trouble I had last time. Oh, thank goodness, thank goodness, thank goodness. Oh, I didn't see you there. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. I feel less stressed. Genuinely, I was I was really stressed to start today's recording and was just like hoping and praying that things go right and that I don't have to like stop recording and swap to until dawn or something because I, uh, you get the point you get the point you get the point now this game oh oh damn oh i see where we are okay cool map so I just did an entire loop-to-loop. -loop. I didn't explore the way where the other scary nurse was and I didn't go to the director's office. Like... Are they angry? Because in the movie, they're not angry. Oh, how charming! A little hand holding a key. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, and a save point? That usually means bad things. Save points and health potions. Don't trust them. Never have, never will. No item. Some sort of a star sun shaped key. Oh. Okay. Oh. 
This is convenient, I can zoom. Why is there three of them? Delusion. What? Patient number 0090. Room number D1. Symptoms. Sensory delusion. Insomnia refuses food, water. Delusions persists. Recommendations. Force feeding and hydration. Bathing required to be carried out of the treatment room. Sleep medication. Constant surveillance. Who would this be? You think these are different people? Yes. Patient number 0130. Move to L1. Intense and unrelenting. And un <laughs> unrelenting. Yeah. Anxiety. Okay. Symptoms have intensified into full blown paranoia. Visual hallucinations. Increase medication. Can't be left alone. Move to L1 for closer monitoring. I didn't flip that one. Can't look at it again. Slip it first to make sure. Patient number 50. Room C1. In what room is, is Mary currently? Or whatever her name is? Sudden outbursts of aggression. Visual and auditorial hallucinations. Current diagnosis. Current therapy is considered effective. Unprovoked outburst. Um, social interactions improved. What did I miss? Continue with current therapy. Water has a calming effect. If uh, it used to. I have a theory. You guys remember I said I wonder if the people we're encountering are actual people? We've encountered the guy with the... That sounds like a Muppet. A woman looking for her mother and a child. I don't think the child would be one of these. But they could be me. I don't think M is real. I think she's just a product of Silent Hill. But I think the child, the man, and the woman looking for her mother are real. And they're also here because they're facing their inner demons and their inner monsters. But... Oh! Okay, okay, I just, I just, I just had the most geniuses of genius brainwaves, and I'm probably so wrong, but... Remember... Are you focusing on me? Hello? Hello? Remember? The child said you never loved Mary in any way and ran off. So I thought the child was not a real person. It was just another thing that Silent Hill made that gave our character a guilty conscience, to put it that way. What if the child is a real person and she knew Mary? Because my suspicions are that Mary was in a hospital, hence why we are now in a hospital. What if the child visited Mary in the hospital or was also in the hospital or was visiting someone in the hospital and talked to Mary and then she came to Silent Hill to find out more about Mary and then she found us instead and then said like, oh, you never cared for her in any way. And maybe because she's a child, she's not seeing any of the monsters because she doesn't have inner demons. She's just a child in a town. Just saying, what are you doing? I don't know what my hair is doing. It's curling this way instead of that way. It's okay, let me just move on. I, I know I talk too much, I'm sorry. I need wristbands. Three wristbands. Oh! Three wristbands. It's these three's um, hospital bands. Yeah, surely. Oh, I don't like things like this. Mm -mm. Oh. 
Not at all what I thought would be behind here. Um, am I supposed to know this? I don't... Yeah, I don't... Okay, okay. Yeah, no. I don't have the solution to this problem quite yet. Okay, and I know I need those three patients' wristbands. Audio log. Not to be delusional, but that sounded like Pinhead, not gonna lie. I'm gonna save again and then we can move on. Why do I always call the poor man Pinhead? It's Pyramid Head. Where did she go? sorry she has a weapon i'm not screwing around with it now you guys can see my lovely aim it's amazing right please die sorry why are their faces so I'm sorry. I'm playing too much horror games. Goodness no. It's because me and Trip Switch Gamer, fellow YouTuber friend, go check him out if you have not played Demon Knowledge just last night. Bunch of fun, but I just thought that was someone hanging upside down. Yeah. Nothing makes me angrier. Nothing. Like, you're promising me meds. And then there's nothing. Open it, there's a key. Oh, okay. Looped again. Nice. Sorry. Training in the game as well as outside. Kind of vibe. Here for it. Love a good atmosphere. <sighs> I keep getting shotgun ammo. It's bad of me to say that I do not want shotgun ammo. I literally can't remember if I've already said this or if I've or if I said it in the video that I filmed and then had to redo. But I'm so worried because you guys said that there are multiple endings and the only way that logically I would say how to get multiple endings in a game like this is that breathing. But is with the things I interact with, meaning the things I kill, or the notes I read, or the notes I don't read. Or like, talking to Mary additionally, or... Things like that. But who knows? These things are memories. These things are reminding him of his past. I'm telling you. Because why are we in a hospital? Why is he looking at this? And you know, Silent Hill was a place where he and his wife used to hang and be. Like, what if she was one of the three people on the list and she was so ill that they had to like restrain her 
Hence why some of the monsters look like they're restrained females, because he can't get that image out of his head. That's the only thing that makes sense to me, is what if she was like beyond saving and he just had to watch her get worse and worse and worse. M1. It's not one of the places that was listed. Another key is required. I don't like these jar door. <laughs> Can you hear things? A little bear. This could have been the girl's bear. The girl and Mary could have been here together. Acupuncture? Isn't that an acupuncture needle or is it something you put in the arm? Yeah, isn't that one of those things you put in the arm so that the little tube can go inside of it? Can you pick a lock with that game logic? So maybe. Oh, I see you. Mm. Press one to equip the handgun. Press two to equip the shotgun. I'm keeping that for Pinhead. Did you hear that? I feel like something's gonna jump out. Yes! I have five drinks and five syringes and a shotgun. I do not feel comfortable. I know I'm supposed to feel more comfortable because... Because I'm technically better equipped now. No! No! I'm reloading! Oh. I have a new mouse. I don't know what my key binding is anymore for healing. I, I have a new guy. Um... Is it you? Oh. <sighs> Sucked. <laughs> I've already killed the monster in this whole way. Why am I hearing it again? Oh no! Oh no! Oh! Ugh. I don't even know where to go anymore. I've seen so many jokes on this game where people had to watch up tutorials as to where to go. Luckily, I have not fallen into that situation yet. I've been fairly. Okay. And finding my way. And wasting my ammo. Something's watching TV in here. No! 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 Sorry! Oh, I don't... Oh. The nurses make noises when they get hurt. L1. L1 is one of the patient's rooms. 
It was the patient that was moved to L1 um, due to seeing things. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Ah! This game is such a troll, honestly. Like, look, multiple med packs. I mean, that doesn't mean there has to be something in it, I know, but still. Like, at this point, I wouldn't be surprised if I do a puzzle and there's nothing in it. I shouldn't say that. I have a bad habit of, like, foreshadowing things. It's funny, I would foreshadow so many things, and then at the same time, I'm the most oblivious gamer ever. I would, like, walk past things, not notice. But then the next moment, I would be a genius. So inconsistent. Oh, oh, oh. Why does it look different? Is it just me? Is it just me or does it look di did it look different? You okay? Open. Why is there two of them now? Where am I supposed to go? To L1. How do I get to L1? Key. Oh, I'm slouching. Ah! Oh, it's just the door. It made like a cat a little bit. Have a good look at everything to see if I can figure out. What the situation is. What is that noise? Did you hear that? Am I losing it? It sounded like a door. The moment I touched this thing. And then I heard... Crackling noises. I wish I could save. I wish I could save out of the bottom of my heart. <laughs> Doctor. Doctor's coat. Photos. They brought in the girl today. Poor thing hasn't said a word. She just sits there, head in her hands, sobbing and quivering. I moved her to the corner bed. Seems to have calmed her down a bit. She even smiled at me, I think. The little girl. This is the little girl? And she met Mary in this hospital? in this ward sure of it that looked like a person oh a p 
pillow fort. It's the corner bed. It's a pillow fort. Can't I interact with it? A nurse in there for sure. Everything's fully reloaded. What are all these noises? I, I keep going quiet because I'm trying to listen because I keep hearing... Sorry for making invasive noises in your ears, but I keep hearing... Ever so slightly, ever so faintly. No! What's wrong with you? What is with this guy and going into small spaces? He jumps in holes. He pushes hands through places that no sane human would put their hand in. Do you just like narrow spaces? How you get? How are you gonna get out now? Hmm. What was the plan? What was the thought process? Be glad you can push that and it's not concrete. I hope it squishes a few monsters that I don't have to deal with. Whoa. One does not simply grow strong and dumb. Okay. Does my map work? It does. I am now where? I am back to the first floor. Is that correct? Massive hospital. Why would you do that? Like, you could have just used the stairs. I don't understand. Maakai. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just crawl through. I hope something doesn't grab your foot. Don't trust you. Ah! Thank you. You were one of the good ones. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A band. Yeah, there are numbers on it, so it is one of the patients, for sure. Oh, oh I thought there was another one cr climbing out of the hole. I just had a full-blown jump. I don't know if you guys saw, but I just, like, had a full-blown jump. Why won't they help me? Why do they keep me in here with him? The other guy? This could be the girl and she could be referring to the guy with the blue hair that ate the ice cream weird, Jake, Jacob? Okay. Is that everything in this cursed room? Oh, had a few stutters there, but so far it's been going really well. Very happy with that. Oh. Just the rain. Why is the window open? The horrors from outside is going to come inside. 
Beautiful. I like the rain a lot. Nothing to check. Oh, I'm only realizing where we are now. We're all the way back here. Still closed. Okay, so we have to go to the doctor's lounge, which is straightened up. Was this always open? There's medicine. Don't trust it, okay? I just don't. And neither should you. Where's the shot? What else do I have to do on this floor? The pool. Can I get to the pool? I don't think so. I think I need to open that middle door. I wonder if I can go to D1, but I probably need a key for D1. I've not gone up there at all. I can just check and try to go up the stairs, right? I feel like that's the next logical thing to do, because I do not think I can get to the pool in any way. So let me check. Where am I? I just got immediately lost. Where am I? Lobby. This way. Let me see how far the stairs can take me. Okay, the stairs might give us some drops. They usually do because it's like loading in a new area. Oh, why would they bring me down here if I... couldn't use it yet? Okay. Now I'm up here. The stairs are up. And this way. Why do they keep standing up? I'm just gonna run for it. She's still dead. Don't tell me there's one behind me as well. Shoot the knees. Just hit her back. Just hit her back. No, 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 no. You're supposed to help people, not hurt people. Wasted so much ammo. Wasted so much ammo. Another bunny picture and a bird. Oh. Something singing. Something singing. Like, listen to this. Oh. 
Hey. Oh. Are you okay? Just you. Go away. Don't be afraid. I just want to talk. I'm sure she's going to tell us some of the truth once we've actually caught up to her. hearing evil from everywhere. And these nurses are devouring my ammo. Because I'm very scared of them. No! Stunlocker! Stunlocker! Do it! Do it! Do it! Do it! Be a man! Oh, where is she? Dodge! 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 Keep dodging! Keep dodging! Dodging! Okay. Great! No, 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 no. Mm. I want to shotgun you in the face so badly, so very badly. Shoot her. No, no, shoot. Hit her. Hit her. Two bullets. That's it. Just two. No medication. Nothing. Two bullets. They're wearing different shoes. No, they're not. Girl, play Silent Hill for the first time. Oh, look at their shoes. Okay. I don't wish to go up there quite yet. I don't know why there is a up there. And I don't wish to find out. D2. Just make some noise so that the nurses can kill me. Ah, uh, inner ward. Good. Ah, uh, that's what we were looking for, I believe. It's the downstairs door. Dr. Andrews, we delivered the radio graphics and requested... You requested it. <laughs> However, it looks like the file was incomplete as one of the pictures was nowhere to be found. We will send somebody as soon as we locate it. Let me know if you need anything else. What is that? Pictures of the brain. What? Huh? Skull? Trauma from childhood. Are the markers supposed to line up? Old. I'm assuming I need another picture? I don't know if I should line it up with the marker. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I need another picture like it said in the note. Okay. of the pelvis area so this is childhood trauma and this is old track chicha um f 
four. Four? Should I keep that picture? I'm doing it for in case? Is there more than one way you can put these? I don't think so. The reason why I'm asking is I wanted to see if I can uncover more from one thing, but no, they clearly line up in one way. And I think I need more. Ooh! Thank you. Much appreciated. No x-ray pieces in here? X-ray viewer. Oh, this is D1. But I thought I had a key for it. Oh! Disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Someone was sitting here looking in. Writing reports. Ugh. Day one. Patient transferred for observation. This is 0090. This might be his wife. Shallow breathing avoids eye contact. Agitated in presence of staff. Frantic and no notion of touch. Eh? Day two. Refuses solid food. Force feeding required. Aha! Administer to reduce nausea and vomiting. These monsters are representing his wife. That's why they throw up and that's why they're in straight jackets and that's why they look like females. Patient restrained for bathing and feeding. Prepare the treatment room accordingly. Ugh. Oxygen deficiency, self-injury. Could not confirm. Therefore, something is very wrong. What'd you scribble? What did you scribble? Mm-mm. No, I don't like this. No. This this is getting deep and I I'm I'm not vibing. Oh I have to go up here. This is like playing Outlaws, the first game. But it's worse. Okay, now I have to go back all the way down. Um, yeah. There's so many places I can't go into yet. So I don't think I can do the x-rays. But I'm gonna go all the way... Yeah, down here to go open this. Um, so yeah, I'm probably just gonna run down there and cut to if anything happens. Otherwise, I'll meet you down there. <sighs> I feel safe in the elevator. It just feels right. Okay. First floor. Why? Nurse is coming out of hiding. I feel like it's partially- I handled that great. I feel like it's partially my fault because when we got to the hospital, I said something like, Oh, there's no nurses. Such an idiot. Sometimes feel like it's better to just shoot the knees. 
Well, that makes me feel like I'm on the right track. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm just gonna let the area load. Okay. Yeah, these are the ones that are basically in straight jackets. Okay, now I feel like I can have a look. I feel like this is more dead endy, so I want to start here. Elevator. Close door. I was so wrong. Just so wrong about everything. Objective wants me to go to the pool. So why am I here, pray tell? Yes, fall to the ground! I really hate the noises the nurses make. It's too... No. <laughs> hearing gross noises everywhere. I'm hearing gross noises everywhere. I'm missing a song to make myself feel better. Hearing strange noises everywhere. E. There's so many of them. Mold remover. Ew. Oh, that was my bad. does not work as well, it's just shooting, shooting the legs. Five. Still good. It's in the walls, deep inside the mold. Remove... get rid of it for a while, but then the thing reappears in exactly the same spot. We need to get in there, break it all down, if we have to. And root it out. Ew. This building was falling apart. Oh. Monday, breakfast, lunch. You're just watching TV. I'll... I'll... <sighs> You just watch television, okay? You just... just watch your show. 
keep watching your show. I saw it. I just saw it too late. I saw it. I just saw it too late. No, 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 no. No. Regain control of the situation. Regain control of the situation by running away as fast as I can. My goodness, it healed everything. Okay. Where the hell am I? Oh shoot, look! I'm all the way back here! Damn. Okay, so instead of going back that way, I'm gonna go back this way because this is a new environment. So I do want to check if we ran into all the doors. Checked all the nooks and crannies. Yeah, okay. And then head to where I was supposed to go. And this is also now open. Yes, frame drops, but there's always frame drops on the stairs because it tries to load in the new area. But let me just walk for a bit. See if it will regather itself. nurse noises. Like they sound like they're struggling. They're the most human sounding out of them all. I can't drink a potion after every encounter with them though. That's a bit of a problem. Like, listen to them. <laughs> they, they lunge so far. Oh, stop. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. I thought you were gonna go on your knees! Okay, no, this is bad. I keep getting injured, and I don't want to drink a potion immediately, but what if being injured is gonna, like, affect my sanity or something? This case bears a disturbing similarity to a situation that took place in the facility a few years back. The patient was admitted on a court order, but with the consent of his remaining family. The guy with the ice cream. The condition appears to be improving for the first two weeks. The administrated medications paired with individual sessions with a psychologist and art therapy elevated his evaluation and social withdrawal there was no reason for concern they didn't even know anything was wrong until the night guard reported one of his keys was missing when they found him it was already too late okay so this is not one of our people Bad. Why? Password for something? 
my gallery sometimes has the strangest things on it because of games I play. Hopefully I keep this. Okay, I do keep it. Keypad combination note. I'm assuming I have to pair that with something, but with what? I'm a bit at a loss with the keypad. But I'm sure I'll get there. Hi. Slowly but surely. Oh, I have three again. I, I really... Mm -mm. I don't know what's better. Use my medication. Uh, or And then not my ammo. Or... Honestly, it's a skill issue. I know, but... Shut up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Give it a moment. Let it cook. Oh. I've been dreading to go down here. And this one is the least scary out of them all. Okay. Wait, how do I get to the pool? If I can't get into the shower room... I can't go in here. I can. Huh. But I've been in here. How on earth do I get to the pool? I'm officially at a loss. I think I'm gonna go to the keypad because I did get the note thing. Where's my picture? For the keypad? So... Where am I now? Let me go to the keypad. I will see you there. Wait, isn't this a room where... The nurses respawned and I didn't kill them? I do believe so. Yeah. Keypad. Oh, okay. Keypad. Where's my picture? Three, five, seven, eight? Three, five, seven, eight? Hee hee hee. Hee hee Okay. They fed me garbage and rotten meat crawling with maggots. Ugh, thick with snee. They made me bite down the juicy red and yellow, hit the back of my throat. I choked and I gagged and I vomited till my throat is sore. An aching, throbbing tube of flesh. I push it all out, but I can still taste it. Please tell me that's not your wife. Ah, oh. you molded, molded. Oh, I understand. Yee. Um, I probably have to use the mold spray on it. No, 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 combine it. No, just... Okay. You. So I can take the hand now back to... Sorry, that was... <laughs> hmm. Hmm. To there. 
which is just up here. Ooh. No. Mm -mm. No. Like, I'm not squeamish, but I'm too sensitive for that. Uh, let me save. Let me not be dumb. I didn't want to save because I think... I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm just gonna... Mm -mm. Just gonna shut up and go to the x-ray room. Where was the x-ray room? All the way around. Right? Hmm. Through the window? <sighs> Under here? Four? Seventy-seven twelve? Is that... Correct? Four seven seven one two? What did you write down? That the extra room is complete. Oh! Combination lock! Four three seven twelve! Four three... Seven twelve. Where's the lock? I appreciate them doing that because I thought it was seven seven. I didn't see that as a three. Where's the lock? Four three seven twelve. Four three seven. Oh. 12. Okay. I was scared I would have to do it like the other one where you have to rotate it perfectly. Oof. Oof. Oh. 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 I feel like all of my keys are pointing to the pool area. I just don't know how to get into the shower room, into the garden. I don't know. So I'm gonna go down there. I'll see you there. Okay. How do I go about this? Because I feel like I'm missing something. Somewhere. Here. Because from the shower you room you can go into the pool. And... Whoops. And I need to go into the pool. There's a door here that is blocked off. Genuinely gave me a fright. Have I been here? Oh, this is new, this is new, this is new. Where am I? Pharmacy. Ew.
What do I do with the drain? Um, he got out of the pool and made a break for the garden, cutting himself wide open in the process. Thank goodness I was still there. He was completely manic, screaming. I, I had to hold him down. Barely managed to stitch him up. He's back in his room now, sedated. I feel like... Where should I go from the garden? This is massive! bullets why can i not hit this one what's this i think it was stuck in the plants or something there we go yeah i think the plants screwed it up a bit okay i don't vibe with this area thank you for asking nor did I think I was going to go to a new or Here we go! How dare you! These are my least favorite enemies. Syringe. Oh, a floor one. Yeah, yeah, come to me, so I can kill you fast. Okay. Good, good. Good. Anything else? Use my ammo on you for sure. The nurses are scary, yeah, because they have weapons, but those ones, I don't know. They're just next level. I'm assuming I'm in the greenhouse now. And I'm in the pool. Great. Really not in the mood. Okay, thank goodness I can't go in there. Okay, I need a key for that. Um, why would there be anything? And there's something- oh, it's just a bug. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Should've known! Should've known! Oh, thank you. What's this? A tube. Okay. What now? Okay, I'm thinking this is the right place to be, because enemies? Don't, don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! No more! 
was this one here in the corner? I knew I should have hit her. Now I'm here again. Ooh! Uh... Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Don't know what that yeah was, ma. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so surprised he didn't just see the hole and try to shove his hand in it, because that's what he does. Who are you? Can't even see. Maintenance key? Oh. Collected? Game? I'ma just- I'ma just give my game a moment, if you will. Okay, I just quickly came back here to find my little save room now! Don't be confused. So I will, after this little footage you're seeing now, post a little clip of how much my game broke for those of you who are curious to see it. So don't be confused. I am finishing off right now, but first I'll show you a clip of what happened to my game and how busted it was. And then we're going to my outro, essentially. So yeah, we're done for now. Don't be confused. Um. Those are sparks, it's not a monster, correct? Whoa, did you see that stutter? I don't know why, but this game struggles. It's a nurse! It's a nurse, guys! It's a nurse! She has a weapon. Ugh. Oh, the stutters are so annoying. Like, that was a full blown freeze! Give me a sec, let me quickly jump into my settings. So it's not written down on tiny pieces of paper. I am going to restart the game at this point. What's the Darth Vader breathing? I keep hearing creatures. I don't wanna, ah, go down. I don't know what to do. Why'd he pull out his gun? I can't deal with these frames. I cannot deal. Like, like, look at that! Look at that! How are you guys supposed to watch this? No! I'm gonna have to fix this. Yeah, no, this is impossible. Like, I cannot record. <laughs> Oh, this video is a failure. Let me just loot this and I'll run back to a save point and I'll see what I can do. Okay, so... Um... Um... Yeah. I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay guys, on that note, we will be ending today's video right here. Now, this might sound stupid, but I'm very excited for today's outro because I have my very first YouTube member editing skills make it display. Ah! I have my very first YouTube member and that is just so exciting to me and I'm sorry, but I'm going to be cringy for a moment. If you don't care, just skip and then I'll just thank you for watching. I appreciate it and Thank you. But if you are staying for the cringy, then I just want to say thank you so much because I have my first YouTube member and it is a tier three member. And one of the bonuses is you get displayed on my screen like a little credit roll. A few of them have the credit roll display thing, but there are different tiers. So this is the current highest tier one. So <laughs> it's probably not gonna do the credit roll thing because it's only one unless I should make it do that and it's kind of gonna be funny anyway so this is a a rather special member to me because it is probably one of my biggest supporters of this channel and it is not one of you guys 
that's wait wait that sounds bad my point is a lot of you guys support my channel a lot and i know a lot of you want to get membership and i do appreciate that a lot but what i mean with it's not one of you i mean like it's not someone you would see in my comment section all that much because this person is the bane to my existence but also my partner in crime so i just want to say very 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 special thanks to my very first member and it is celestial hook once again partner in crime bane to my existence he has helped so much on this channel hence why i'm saying i'm just gonna nerd out for a moment because i'm not good with technology and a lot of times things would go wrong or like my silent hill would not work and he would always be the first one i would ask for help and then he would fix my problems for me so that it's not something that i have to stress about or worry about too much because i know i have someone i can just always rely on or ask for help or know that you know things are gonna be okay because i always have that special person that has my back through every problem i have or <laughs> every let's call it mood swing or drama or anything it's just nice it's very special to me that this is my first member because yeah a lot of things i do on this channel honestly would not have been done if it was not for him like some of the technical difficulties i have that i just don't know how to sort out because i don't have that knowledge and you know it just makes such a big difference and another example is he actually bought me until dawn for my birthday so that's something that i might not have played on the channel and it's a game that i was like super excited about but it's a bit expensive but you know all those all those little things that could add worry or add stress is just lightened a lot by said person, said member. So yeah, <laughs> I, I always get kind of shy sharing things like that. Again, this is such a long outro, but I'm not honestly that good at sharing things about myself or being like, let's call it open and vulnerable so i like sharing things like this with you guys so that you can get to know me better and who i am as a person and i love getting to know you guys so yeah this is me sharing and showing my appreciation so thank you so much for being my very first member <laughs> but yeah just having a member is very special to me because again starting youtube is kind of scary because i'm like is it gonna work is it not gonna work am i wasting my time are people even gonna like my videos and just being able to say i have youtube membership active is honestly a little mind-blowing for me because i feel like it's showing that i'm doing something right if that makes sense and i'm actually getting somewhere and you guys are here with me through every step of the way through all my technical difficulties <laughs> through all my bugs and my issues and me learning how everything is working and how everything is and it's just a very special thing to me so thank you so so much for each and every person who watches my videos each of every person who shares them who likes them who leaves an amazing comment so that i can read it and I don't know i don't i really don't know how to put it in words other than i just truly appreciate it and it's a very surreal moment to me i feel like it's things that can be taken for granted especially if you're used to let's say like big youtubers and make a bunch of money but just having a member and having membership is just you know a milestone achieved and i just feel really thank thankful for it and it's because of you guys it's because of everyone who follows and everyone who subscribes and tells me that you enjoy my content so truly thank you <laughs> genuinely appreciate it out of the bottom of my heart so thank you so much to each and every one of you and thank you for watching my very long outro i really appreciate it so see you guys in our next spooky adventure. Bye!